where it could take place. Although I think if you wanted a real short squeeze, you'd probably want a more levered company where people were truly like it was on the verge of bankruptcy and then it suddenly it's not. GameStop, I don't know. I, we just got to see what happens, but it would be nice if it goes up really quickly. But when you see all this stuff kind of adding up, you need to at least consider it, take it into consideration. But uh, yeah, if the start tart, if we get closer to, the, this is what I mean, we're in July, the console cycle is right around the corner and it's still pricing the gutter. It's pretty impressive to me. But next couple months, maybe a sentiment will start to turn, chart will start to turn up. People start seeing that, uh, I feel like if people start seeing Barry's involved too, that could help because um, he's a legitimate, successful value investor, knows his shit and see the activists and the management's making moves and stuff. Um, maybe it could happen in the, uh, the this by the end of 2020, but um, probably within, the thesis should unfold fully within 18 months. If it doesn't happen by then, I don't know. I do think GameStop's gonna be, seems likely to me it's gonna be bought out by a PE firm who sees what I see and thinks, all right, we, let's take this thing private and start, um, we can start taking out the free cash flows and stuff. I think that'll happen. It, they, it almost happened a couple of years ago in 2018. And at that time it was priced, it,